Let's get going with this lunge class, lean class. So we're going to start on our TRX, mid-length on your straps, yellow tabs covering up the diagonal lines. Grab your handles, feet or shoulder width apart, and squat. Sit down, drive through the heels of your feet to stand up. Get one more squat and now mid rows handles are into your armpits elbows are driven down and back lean back in row chase those nice strong planks let's get one more row and now combine it, squat, row, squat, down, drive up, and row. Let's get one more squat down drive up and row spin and turn facing away from your anchor we're going to go alternating leg forward lunges eyes wise t's right leg and the eyes stepping forward press down through your handles to help drive and bring yourself up On your next one, wise. Taking your handles just a bit wider. And on the next one, tease. Really open up your chest. One more to each leg, right and left, and then standing rollouts, offsetting your stance if you like, lean forward, let the handles go up above your head, <clears throat> engage your core and pull back. Let's get one more, rolling it all the way out. Engage your core, pull back. Spin and turn, face that anchor again. Golf rotations, feet are nice and close together, slight bend in your knees and right arm driven up. And left. One more to each arm right and left and then stand up nice and tall and hip hinges press through those handles reach forward right legs up in the air stand up nice and tall press reach left leg up in the air One more to each leg, right? And left. Stand up nice and tall. Grab a quick drink of water. Come on back. And we're going to get ready to do this. We're going to do this first round. Okay, we're gonna do the first round for 60 seconds of everything we do, and then uh, we're gonna go 
to the TRX. So we're going to start, I'm sorry, we're going to start on the ground doing some cardio and then we're going to go into TRX. Cardio, TRX, cardio, TRX. Okay. So this first one, you're going to want a soft spot to start off with. And we're going to combine a couple of things. We're going to combine the low tuck jump and a rolling jump. Okay. So there's bit of jumping on this first one. So you're going to start off where we go back, kick your legs back behind you, up, jump, and then tap, tuck, jump, roll it back, up, jump, kick, hands to the ground, tap, tuck, jump again. All right, 60 seconds of this, guys. Starting out, here we go. Two, one, and going. Roll it back. Bring it up, jump, nail your plank, low tuck, jump, down to the ground, roll, up, jump, plank, tuck, whoop, jump. Then set a pace and a rhythm that works for you. Almost there. Grab your TRX handles. We're going to go into alternating leg side lunges. One side to the other. Two, one, go. One side, up, out to the other. Get nice and deep. Chase that plank, ear, shoulders, hips, stacked one right on top of the other. Here we go. Two, one, going. Switch, square, switch, square. So you're hopping your feet across the body, rotating through that waist, and then resetting with those feet square. here. Two, one. Grab one handle. We're going to combine a squat and a power pull. Hand into your armpit. Reach up past your yellow tab. Extend your arm down. Touch the ground behind you. Pull up and row up. Two, one, go.
Almost there. Two, one. Let go of your handles. This time, shuffle. One, two, three. One, two, three. Nice and light on those toes, side to side. Two, one, go. Two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. that core engage heads up chest up come on two one squat power pull other arm grab your handle Set up and go. Drive through the heels of your feet. Big pull. Two and one. Nice, ditch the handles. Okay, we're gonna go into fake jump roping. Are you gonna become the best imaginary jump roper that you've ever been? Here we go. Grab that imaginary jump rope. Two, one, going. So start off just getting your rhythm with it. Then you can start getting fancy with it. Switching one foot to the other doing doubles, triples, whatever works for you. Jump rope, jump rope, jump rope. Almost there. When we transition onto our TRX, we're gonna lengthen it all the way out. Two, one. Lengthen your straps all the way out. Face away from your anchor. Chest fly. Palms face each other. Offset your stance if you'd like. Lean forward. Close those hands across your chest. Two, one, going. Close. Keep that core nice and tight. Focus on your back and your hips, making sure that you're not starting to arch through that lower back, pushing your hips forward. Stay flat, drive it all the way out. If you're in an offset stance, Bend your front knee, allow that weight to be taken up on that front leg, and then support your arms to come back. Two. 
two, and one. Nice. Ditching the handles. We've got one more cardio burst. Our cardio, our cardio, our cardio burst on this one is going to be switch kicks. So kicking your leg out to your side, one side to the other, one side to the other. Last bit of cardio. Two, one, going. So you're aiming for height and then speed. Keep your core nice and engaged. water. Nice job guys. Okay. The next one that we're going to do we're going to do two activities, each of them for 45 seconds, and we're going to repeat it. We're going to do it twice, okay? So our first one that we're going to do is going to be off of the TRX, and it's going to be a plank walkout. So you're going to stand up nice and tall. You're going to hinge at your waist, bend your knees if you need to, walk your hands out to a plank, walk your hands back, jump, okay? From there, we're gonna grab the handles and you're gonna go right into a front squat. Sit down, stand up, sit down, stand up. 45 seconds of each of these, repeat it twice. Here we go, two, one, walk it out. Walk all the way out, nail the plank, walk it back, jump, out plank, back, jump. Set your own pace and rhythm with this. Almost there, almost there. Keep that core nice and engaged. And grab your handles. Front squats, lean into it. And two, one, go. 45 seconds. Heads up, chest up, look up. Keep those knees tracking in line with your hips. Rest. Back into those plank walks. Two, one, going. Walk it out. Nail the plank. Back, jump. Focus on keeping that core tight. Squeeze your glutes.
Almost there, almost there. Rest, front squats, leaning it in. And two, one, going. Stay strong with this. Nice, knees tracking in line with your hips. Two, one. Okay, we're gonna change the activities out. Skaters on the body weight, and then you're gonna grab your handles, and we're gonna go Wide fly, keep the hands up, overhead squat. Right back down, resetting for that wide fly. Okay, skaters to start, 45 seconds. Two, one, going. Skate, one side to the other. Keep that core engaged. Travel, let that leg go all the way across your body. Rest, grab your handles, walk backwards, face your anchor, and two, one, lean back, Y, keep the hands up, squat, up, lean back, Y, squat, up, lean back, reset your shoulders, Keep that core nice and tight. Rest. Right back into skaters, right back into skaters. Here we go, two, one, and going. Skate and tap. You got this, guys. Rest. Second set. Y to overhead squat. Two. One, go. Y, down, up, reset. Keep your arms nice and straight. out here. We're going to go 
lateral hop, hopping one side to the other with our feet together. So hop, hop, trying for some distance here. And then we're gonna do a high pull into an overhead back extension. So high pull, let the hips sink down, nice straight legs, pull, nice high pull, reset, drive up, overhead back extension. Okay, lateral hops to start us off. Here we go, two, one, go. If the hop is not your game, step, tap, step, tap. Get big steps though, big steps. extension two one go hips down pull reset up Reset your shoulders. Lock it in with that nice strong core. Two, one. Back to the lateral hop. Two, one, go. this round. Grab them and go. I pull overhead back extension. Keep tension on your straps throughout the whole movement. It's easy in the overhead back extension to come up and let your, slat, your straps go slack. Don't let that happen. Keep them tight, which means you've got to keep your body weight leaning back behind you. And water. Nice job, everyone. We've got one more round coming up. We're gonna do ah. We're gonna take our straps to mid-length. The yellow tabs are gonna cover up your diagonal lines. And from here, <clears throat> We're gonna do runner skips, and then we're gonna do a standing hip drop. So the runner skip, take one leg, 
Load it back behind you. Keep this leg straight. You're gonna wanna bend it. Don't let that happen. Keep that leg straight. Drive, bring your knee up into your chest. Drive, bring your knee up into your chest. Or you can add a hop if you want, okay? All right, one side, here we go. Two, one, and going. Bring that knee up. Nice straight leg loading back behind you every time. one direction whatever leg is closest to your anchor take a step forward and two one let your hips drop so handles on your head let your hip drop to one side focus on your hips keeping them in line with each other if you want to make it harder bring your feet right next to each other You gotta keep that core nice and tight. Two, one. Runner skip, other side. Ditch the handle, leg back behind you. Two, one, go. Nice straight leg, nice strong core. Two, one, hip drop other side. Lock it in and two, one, go. Okay, take your straps to mid-calf, mid-shin. Rubber handles are right below your kneecaps. Last one in this one, guys. Last one in this one. We're going to set up for heels in. We're going to do a hamstring runner where we pull one knee into our chest, then the other knee. We're going to start by doing a little cardio before that. So our cardio before that, we're going to hit a plank, and we're going to go shoulder, shoulder, knee, knee foot foot okay so you're on the ground shoulder shoulder knee knee foot foot here we go two one and going shoulder shoulder knee knee foot foot Almost there, almost there. Two, one, down to the ground, heels in, hamstring runners. This is gonna end this, you guys. Stay strong here. Hips come up and go. One leg in, then the other. Equal pressure in your foot cradles. Think about scraping mud off of the back of your foot as you pull your leg in and push away. Keep your knees tracking in line with your hips. 
Don't let them wobble about. Last few seconds here. Two, one. Let your hips down. You guys are done, done, and done. Whew, nice job today, you guys. Grab some water. Let's stretch. Mid length on your straps. Let your hips drop down towards the ground. Head falls in between your arms. Freedom of movement here. Bending one knee. Switching from one side to the other. Finish your last bent leg, straighten both legs out, ground through your legs, look back behind you. Bring it back to center, feet nice and close together, hinge through your hips, freedom of movement here, bend one knee, switching from one side to the other. Finishing your last bent leg, straighten both legs out, press through your handles, come on up. Spin, turn. Right leg steps forward, left leg steps through, reach across your body. Come back to center, switch the legs, left leg out. Right leg steps through. Come back to center. Let a nice stretch come across your chest. Nice job today, everyone. Lean back, step back, walk back. Put those handles underneath the anchor. You're all done. Have a great day. Go forth, conquer the